HelloBoatHistoryReport.com, we brought you here today to let you know that we made the business decision to switch to BoatAlert.com. Switch? You mean like I'm being replaced? BoatHistoryReport.com, your performance has been, well, there are, missing features. Missing boat listings. Lack of innovation. No online boat sales data nor in MVTIS data. Also, no liens checks. No boat value calculator and no model number lookups. Worse, your reports do not have owner names data and very little Canadian data for years on end. But you know I just have my way of operating. I know, and we really appreciate everything you've done but we really cannot rely on missing boat history data with you on the team. There is also poor and slow customer support. Okay I get it but I can change. I can work harder. Sorry, we considered the fee hikes you implemented in 2023, and it's just not affordable for the average consumer anymore, BoatAlert.com already has it all for $20 compared to $60 you charge. They give up-to-date information, innovative features, fast customer support, and boat sales listings data from tons of sources. They even show eBay, Mannheim and Odessa auctions as well as Hindicoder.com data. Come on. It's not that bad. Okay that's enough. How many times have we caught you sleeping on the job or withholding payments to some affiliates commissions? You also have conflicts of interest with some employees working on boards of other boating associations and organizations. But I can explain really. I think we are done here. It's not you, it's just that BoatAlert.com has set sail to a new level in the boat history business with the most categories of data and lowest price, leaving you in its wake. Close the door behind you.